Okay. Hello, everybody. Welcome back to my channel. Today's episode is going to be about the L'Oreal Mercier Loose Setting Powder, the new version, Deep. Yes. Now, I have the first one. I think I had put it in one of my favorites in the past episodes. If I can find it, I'll put it down in the description box for you guys. It was the original loose setting powder that I love till this very day and I swear by. And it was a translucent powder just like the new one with no color, which meant that as you applied it, it didn't take away from you. There wasn't any overcast, nothing like that. It set the makeup as as it promised and that was that but as all things people evolve makeup evolves and somewhere down the line Loria Massier somebody said you know what let's do one in deep for the darker complexions for the women of color for women with deeper skin tones for women that are not Caucasian which was a fantastic idea and it was all over Instagram, it was all over YouTube, it was everywhere. I had to get my hands on it. Now, this is the original and this is the new one. I'm going to stop right there. The L'Oreal Mercier original was fantastic because it didn't give me an overcast, it didn't give me flashback, it didn't give me anything. And that was the thing. It didn't give anything back but the deep does because it brings back my color. When I got the original, I found that I wanted a little punch underneath my eye. I was happy that it didn't have an overcast. Very happy with that because I have terribly oily skin and I always blot my skin throughout the day. Throughout the day, I always have to blot. So I was really happy that this did not have any overcast. It didn't build up. It didn't have any flashback or anything, yeah? But I still wanted some color. I felt that with all the powders that one wears, that's why you need to have the finishing spray and the dewy skin mist because you want to bring your skin back to life. And I would take my topaz from Benai and I would mix it with my L'Oreal Mercier Loose Setting Powder Original to give it that extra punch. I say this because when they released the deep, I promise you, I found myself saying, Laura Mercier, there's somebody in that company that's my spirit animal. The very thing that I was doing was the very thing that they came up with to sell. And just to show you, this is the Laurier Messier loose setting powder. This is the original. This is the color. Yeah? Okay. And then let me show you the deep. There you go. Yeah? Original deep. Original deep. <laughs> Fumi's concoction. And that is what I would do. Mix my topaz with the original Mercier and that is how I would set my powder because I needed that extra punch. I needed that extra color. And so when they brought out the deep, this was the answer to everything. Without yeah. any further ado, let us go into the demonstration. And I went all the way, my loves. I stripped off everything, should I say. And we started from scratch. Enjoy. And I'll see you after the demo, okay? So I have this vaporizer that I bought and I love putting like a lovely light film of mist before I start my makeup. This is something new and I just like it because I feel that my skin, sorry, I feel like my pores just kind of open up. All right, next stage, I'm gonna go with my Smashbox Photo Finish Foundation Primer. I'm loving this, it's brand new. I usually use the um, Benefit Pore Professional, but then again, my skin can be funny. So when the weather changes, the seasons change, I also change certain products and brands. It's just the way it is, what can I tell you? All right, so let me put some on. Au revoir. Looking good, Fumi. <laughs> and then I go with my, my Vanish Stick Foundation by Hourglass. I have the color Espresso. It is the best. It matches my complexion perfectly. So we're going to use this. Then I'm going to go with my Artiste Brush Over 8 and we're going to blend it all in. Use your forefinger on top of the brush because I found that the neck of this Artiste Brush can be delicate. And I've broken the first one that I had. This is my second or maybe even my third. So 
use this for support and just blend that in. Another product that I'm loving is the Tip Shape by Tarte. I have the color Deep and it's gorgeous. Love it, love it, love it, love it. This is the Dofer. See how lovely, yummy and big it is? So I just put that in, just swipe it through onto my cheeks, my cheekbone. And then we blend with my beauty blender. I also have a tutorial on a beauty blender. I'll put that down in the description box below. <laughs> and we just buff in. And then for the fun part, we're going to go into our Laura Mercier loose setting powder in deep. And this, my loves, is the star of the show. And just look at how it melts, literally melts into my skin. I love uh, this. Now this is the other powder, the original. Let me show you what it is on this side, yeah? So you see, it doesn't have any color. And that's a good thing because it's a really great product. The difference here, which is very slight, is that this warms up my complexion. Where this doesn't take anything away, it doesn't add anything. Whereas the deep adds to my complexion. So it gives me that flush of color, just enough to round me out and bring back that golden yellow undertone that I already have. And that slight difference makes a huge difference in your makeup. And I wanted to show you because I don't want to deceive you in any way, shape or form. The original is fine. You don't necessarily need to buy the second one, but you can see the difference. This is a much beautiful flush of color warmer. This is very complementary to darker complexions. But just look, just look. I love it. I love it. And that is it, my loves. I just wanted to demonstrate for you guys. <laughs> And uh, now I'm going to go back. I'm going to do the full face and we're going to, you know, finish up. Yeah. All right. Mwah. Voila. Full face. Like you saw in the beginning. But then now you see I put on all of my makeup. Just look at my skin. Just look. Just look at my skin and my neck. How about that? Just look. You want to have your foundation. You want to have even your powder just to set the oil and not look too ashy, overcast. You just want to look like yourself. Yeah? Do you agree, ladies? Can I hear an amen? Ula, can I hear an amen? Amen. <laughs> so let's have a little review and I'll give you my humble opinion. How much is it? It's $32 on the Sephora website. It is not here in London yet. So I had to order it from Sephora. It came in no time at all. I think about of like four or five days. Ladies that live in London, be mindful that you're going to have shipping fees as well as tax fees. So I don't know how much that comes to, but it does come to be much more than the $32 because we girls live in England. Yeah? Okay, okay. So if you're asking me, is this FDV approved? It is absolutely FDV approved. Is it expensive? Ish, ish, ish? Yes. If you want to spoil yourself, go right ahead. Knock yourself out. But for women with deeper skin tones, deeper skin tones, and you want that under eye setting powder perfection, grab this. Grab this. The rent can wait grab it you will be so happy i loved it and because of you guys because you guys give me so much feedback i am now channeling my channel <laughs> to cater to you because you're letting me know what you want 
and I'm beginning to realize that there is a huge vacancy for makeup, for beauty, for everything and anything, for women with deeper skin tones, with really, really deep skin tones. It's not out there. And I'm so honored that you rely on me to give you a sincere review. And that was why I did this standalone episode. I love this. I love this very much. And the way I feel about this, I would absolutely humbly uh, request that Laurier Mercier does many shades of this. Try to do different undertones if they can. All the way from lily pink to a darker shade of this and a couple of shades lighter than this. That way I think that you open up to all women because we are just not two shades. It is creamy, it is velvety, it absorbs right into my skin. Now do I think that it is a necessity? absolutely for women of my complexion for women of my complexion and down think of lupita nyongo think of naomi campbell think of iman think of grace jones that's who i think of when i think of my complexion we've got that rich delicious dark chocolate and every woman further down this is a great under eye setting powder because it highlights our face if you are lighter, it can become a powder to set your face. Get this, guys. For deeper skin tones, Lupita Nyong'o, yes, yes, you can leave a comment below. <laughs> this is for us, girl. Okay? I'll see you in the next episode. Take care. Much love. Bye-bye. <laughs>